polishing the diamond on this class prv all right you guys hope everybody's doing well i'm just gonna show you real quick or a quick view of the before uh, right under this little rug area there's some storage space i'm just gonna push this forward to show you but i don't know to call it my trunk my basement whatever it is it's quite a bit of storage let me get this out of the way so i could show you how much so at first i was only going to put my kitchen things there but then there's plenty of room so i'm going to put some paperwork and pictures and kitchen stuff just a various amount of things whatever fits in there i'll just have to see I was actually surprised how much room is in here for a little bitty car like the Prius you're kind of shocked at how much storage it actually has and how much it can carry I can even store things right where this donut is the spare tire but I'm not gonna do that unless I absolutely have to I don't see myself needing to I don't want to mess with the tire so I'll just put this tray back but once I fill this tray I will show you what I put in it that way I don't have to move the bed once I put the bed on here. I plan on moving all of my things within a few days to a week. Once I do that, I'll give you a full tour so you can see everything that I'm taking with me. But yeah, I just wanted to give you a quick peek before I fill this up. And once I get to filling this up today, I'm gonna show you what I ended up putting. I've downsized so much I'm just trying to put the essentials in here and then a few extras but yeah let me get to it and then I'll show you what it looks like after I'm done putting my things in there so it was too windy outside today so I'm just gonna do a voiceover but these are some of the things that I'm gonna be keeping with me on the road my kitchen stuff and in this big bag I have my paperwork and my pictures just documents basically but this I put more things in this bag so I'll show you I've got two of these containers they are good size and they're actually glass but it's got like a rubber thing around it then I've got my tall Yeti mug and oh this is one of my favorite little mugs it's the coffee is strong with this one <laughs> But there's my second Yeti mug. And then I've got a couple of uh, stainless steel containers. Just when I make my lunches. And then you already saw the other stuff. I've got my Melita drip coffee and my bowls. My stainless bowls. Some uh, forks and spoons. Things like that. But I'm just going to store that bag right there for now. And just try to organize this. But there's surprisingly still even more room that I can put some hygiene or some some other kind of things back here. So yeah, I'm pretty happy about that. There's plenty of room in this little car. But now I'm gonna just set up my bed and start putting my things in here. I got extra blankets, so I just put that maroon one over the fitted sheet just to give me extra insulation. So that's gonna be nice and comfy. Yeah, then I still have this blanket and these two blankets, although the top one's going to go to Cora so she could warm up in the van. And then that bottom one I'm going to use. So I'm going to use these two. And like I said, I'm going to use that maroon one as just more insulation when I lay on it. That's the bag for it. I'm just putting clothes in there. You got to use everything multi-purpose. And this is the food that we're keeping. So we have two big bags. This is actually our DoorDash delivery bags. But for now, we're gonna use them to store our canned food, soups, and some pasta, and things like that, just for the meantime. And once we eat this down, we'll just purchase enough food for maybe a couple days, just to keep it simple. Okay, so it is raining and cold outside. And we're still going to have a few days of cold weather, a few weeks probably on and off. Weather's been crazy, crazy. So I'm super bundled up. 
but I'm gonna try and see if one of these office clips, little paper type of clips, if this helps to hold my, let me get all my cold weather stuff off of here so I don't look like a big old beach ball. But I'm gonna climb back there. I guess I could show you how I would climb if I was in the driver's uh, seat. I just took my shoes off. So I will probably cut out the butt part. But here I go. This is how I would climb back here. Let me throw that back there. There we go. Now, let me get this big cover. And I don't know if you guys can see back here. If not, I'll move the camera back here. Let me try it. Well, it stays. I just have to put a clip on that side and a clip on this side. So Tim, once again, you were right. Let me grab you, get you closer. Yeah. All right, here we go. The clip. Okay, here we go. I didn't think the clip would go in these, in this thing, but there's just enough, like, I don't know if you can see that, like, my fingernail, like, barely goes in there. So, this part right here had enough space to kind of slide in there. I think I can, I don't know if you can see that, but it just barely has enough enough to fit in there. Let me redo that so you can see. You can see the water. Oh, dang. You just have to kind of play with it. No, it doesn't want to go in. Heck. Let me try it on this side. This is the horrible camera work, but I hope you saw that. There you go, just like that. So I'll have to play with it, but I'll put one clip up here and one right here. And there we go. And I thought, well oh dang, my hand's in the way. Well oh dang, I'll just put one more right here and that should be good enough. Maybe even three, I think two, two is okay. They're not gonna be able to see anything. We're just having a little, little gap there. And I will sleep good. These have held in nicely. Of course, I drove today, so I took the other ones out. Dang it. Here we go. It's my blanket for right now. The bed actually feels really nice. Feels comfortable. I've got this fluffy um, Ugg blanket, as you guys already know. Plus I have one of them egg rolls on top of my trifold. So it is comfortable. I was just telling Cora, if, if I feel I need more cushion, I'll just buy a couple more of those little egg roll memory foam cushion things and just put them right here. So yeah, that is how it's coming along nicely. Got plenty of space. Now I thought the bed or was going to cover or my things were going to cover this window, but it's not. Well, anyhow, guys, I am going to edit this video and probably upload it tomorrow. But yeah, all we're waiting on now is to sell the house. And we have a lady that's um, possibly going to purchase the house. 
we shall see Monday, which is tomorrow. We'll see tomorrow if the deal goes through. And we'll update you on that and let you know. But yeah, from my class PRV, peace out. I will catch you on the next one. Bye, guys.